Matt here, Home Farm Ideas, and today I wanted to do a video update on my aquaponic Dutch bucket peppers. You can see the last video that I did on these uh, right here on the card, and I've done I think like three video, three other videos other than this one, and um, you can see kind of the process of how I basically got to where I am now. Um, my peppers are looking really good. The plants uh, just started to suffer a little bit from an iron deficiency, but I fixed it again and they're gonna be off and running in, the, in a few days. But I wanted to show you basically the size difference in the peppers as well in the end of this video. Um, so I do have some peppers that I got from my uh, root pouches that you guys have seen in the last video I posted, which is also right here on this card. And the size comparison is just uh, pretty phenomenal. I mean, these peppers actually grew pretty big. The green peppers or the, the red beauties, um, they grew almost the same, but I didn't pick one in particular pepper from my Dutch buckets that is pretty huge. So anyways, let's get to this one here. Uh, this one, if you guys remember, is the first bucket in the row and it's doing really well. I have one pepper on there that's already turning red, but I wanna harvest because now I'm, I'm wanting to get more greens um, and more flowers to come in. So I need to actually prune this. So I'm gonna take all the peppers off that are um, eatable. Uh, so I'm gonna do that, but I just wanted to show you guys the differences here. So um, the size difference, this thing got a lot bigger and um, it's grown really well. All right, I'm gonna have to move this camera down. I just wanted to show you guys. It is pretty tall. It's about three and a half feet tall. Okay, and that is the second bucket in the row. Super healthy, uh, looking really great. Has huge peppers on it. And I'm gonna cut them off so that you guys can see a little later here. I'm not gonna harvest all of them because I want these things to get bigger. Um, but yeah, second bucket, leaves looking really pimp. I'm gonna bring you in on the leaves as well, but I just wanna show you the rest of the buckets in this row. This is the third bucket here. Um, really good as well, growing really good. Uh, peppers coming in on it. And um, so yeah, let's, let's head down to the last row here and then I'll give you a shot of the last three buckets. In the last video, this bucket in particular, it was already stunted. But I let a pepper go in here, I think a little too long. I'm just gonna bust it off so you guys can see. Um, still good, I'm gonna eat that for sure. We're having pepper steak and some uh, peppers and sausages and stuff like that over the next uh, week or so. So, but anyways, um, I needed to prune that off because I need more flowers and stuff to grow. So we have some already coming in. So, but the pepper plant is looking pretty good. Uh, it was just stunted. Uh, and I don't know why on this one. All right, then here are the last two on the row. And again, really good solid growth. I probably should have uh, topped them. That way they bushed out more, um, but I'm learning. So anyways, everything's looking really good. Let's go in closer and let's uh, harvest some of these peppers. That is my harvest from my um, my root pouches, and now let's have a look at my aquaponic um, harvest. So those are the green peppers from my root pouches, obviously. Same time grown, okay. And these actually look like little pumpkins. Uh, that's better. 
All right, so I mean, size comparison wise, I mean, these are just a lot bigger. Uh, I'll show you in a second when I put down these banana peppers. And then the banana peppers on this side, obviously, is from the root pouches as well. I'm gonna put the other banana peppers on this side, okay? And that is about, I think that's the same amount of peppers as well. Banana peppers, yeah. So those are the banana peppers from the aquaponics system. As you can see, really, um, really huge. Uh, these look really good. I mean, look at that thing. That thing is huge. And I think their biggest one, the biggest one over here. Again, I had problems with these though. I did have problems with these as well, but I fixed it a lot faster than I did these, okay? And then we'll see what happens with the uh, growth after I've done the pruning. And then I'll take the bigger one and I'll take the biggest one here. Uh, if you look at these, this one is taller though, or well, not by much. Here, let me see if I can get a better view here. Okay, but yeah, you can see this one even feels a lot heavier too. So anyways, um, yeah. So that is the size comparison of the two types of peppers. One grown aquaponically, one grown in root pouches. Still all of them good. Um, I'm a little disappointed in these though. But other than that, really good. So anyway, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more videos like this in the future, obviously you need to subscribe so that you can get all my video updates. And ring that bell icon, you guys, that way you guys get all my video updates uh, sent to your inbox um, and anyways uh, yeah check out the description if I have anything in there for this um, I was trying to think of a Dutch buckets if I had anything just other videos that I had in the past that I've done so uh, check those out as well that way you can follow along so anyway God bless you guys and like always peace